All right, this is my attempt to uh, debug this uh, Asus motherboard. Um, read on a new egg review that uh, I think people are having the same problem. Um, booting it up. Comes back with a Q code zero zero. Interesting that the manual says this code's not used. Um, but one of the reviewers on Newegg said that they applied heat over here with a with a blow dryer, and then uh, the board just magically started working. So we're gonna give that a shot with this uh, heat gun. Obviously, I'm not gonna use that high of heat, but uh, we're just gonna apply the heat over to this area. Something's going on. So it looks like that's doing it for some reason. Heat's off. EJ. And we got boot. So that's extremely odd. Um, let's go ahead and power it off. Power cycle. Let it cool off here. All right, so I'm letting it cool off in this area. We'll give it another go. See if the problem reproduces itself. The board's on. It looks like it's booting now. So they have some type of problem with the motherboard sensor. All right, so I turned off the power, let it sit for about five minutes. Uh, let's see what we got. Looks like it's the same problem. So, apply a little bit of heat again. Yeah, I'm doing this from really far away. So, just to give it a little bit of heat. If something's already going on. And there it goes. Looks like it power cycles a couple times before it actually starts booting. So I don't quite understand what that is as far as motherboards go unless they have some type of thermal sensor uh, for the CPU that's being tripped. But looks like it's booting now. As long as there's a little bit of heat applied.